Is that the time? It's time for tea. The idea for this project came about uh, about one year ago. Uh, we'd just finished a project with some young women here at the house doing a promenade performance and Claire Mooney said to us in our evaluation meeting, why don't we do Gaskell the Musical? Uh, sort of a little bit of a... It was almost an off-the-cuff yeah. comment and we sort of took <laughs> we it said, probably more seriously than yes. it was intended. <laughs> yeah, it came about because uh, in passing I just said, do you know what we need next is Gaskell the Musical. So that was about a year ago. And over the months, we've ran with it and just ran with it. So that uh, it got to the point where we managed to get funding and then a good three months hard work to get up to uh, performance. We've had about as many as 30, yeah, I think, come and go throughout the process. And we've used pretty much every idea that has come up. And it's all been through uh, things that have inspired them from just being in the house, things that they've picked up about Elizabeth Gaskell, uh, the debates. overriding, th yeah, some debates that people didn't necessarily always see eye to eye or agree or yeah. saw things slightly differently uh, and all of that has just been used as kind of creative fodder for yeah. uh, the songs and the and the drama. You weren't going to be singing in it, were I you? I didn't realise I was. <laughs> it was a musical. <laughs> I know, there you go, and everybody goes, well, we've come for it but I'm not going to be singing. Yeah, she think, said, okay. can you sing? And I said, why? <laughs> <laughs> I keep thinking, oh, I wonder if it was Gaskell's ghost is watching us because, uh, but it's just beautiful. I love old houses and the fact we're doing it in the place all this occurred and in the very rooms and they brought back to the original state is, a uh, yeah, it really sets the scene for the whole, you know, there's a stage there and it's even better than, you know, what would be on a real stage. It's done me good because I lost my husband 15 months ago and this has really brought me out of myself. Um, and they're a great crowd, the girls, they really are. You know, I'm so lucky to have um, joined a company that's so full of fun and laughter. And I like singing and I like musicals. Oh yes, and I like writing. I'll get involved with that. And so I just came along. I think we all mix in together and bring our experiences and then it just makes the whole complete picture. So I've really loved it. I've been looking at different things to do, but I'm quite shy and Deb so it's kind of work to come with me because I begged her to to this choir and I'm she came did. and then loved it. I love it. The growing confidence and interest in Mrs Gaskell um, has been lovely and they, and they had a, they, there was certainly one afternoon where um, they had I suppose misconceptions about what she was like as a person and they thought how could someone live in a place like this and actually really know what it was like um, to be poor. I think it's been a, like a real area of conflict because it's like all this stuff that I didn't know anything about with Gaskell other than the fact that I know like Deb had worked at the MRI that there are campuses around but I didn't I knew she was a, a, a writer but um, it's, it's quite a bit of conflict there because on the one hand she's like helping the poor and going to prisons and then on the other hand what's your line? A horrible poor person came to the door. Yeah, so she, yeah, so she associated with people who didn't hold the same values that she did. She's done a great job for people, um, especially women. Yeah. And um, it's nice that we can, from years gone, we can still continue to celebrate what she had done for them in the past. I've got to say, I think Muriel said it all here. I think it's uh, absolutely brilliant. I, I remember doing Cranford at school years and years ago and not really bothered much about Elizabeth Gaskell. And since getting involved in the project, it's made me want to read Elizabeth Gaskell books, find out more about uh, Elizabeth Gaskell. I think that we're all, I think it's, she's a very inspirational person. It's a pleasure, really. It's, it's lovely to be in here. It takes you back in that era. Everything. I think, they, I, think I like the, I love the way they dress, although it's a lot of clothes, but I like it, yeah. Um, I just like Victorians, yeah. 
it's just nice to see a the enthusiasm for the project and you know people saying oh well stop i think she might have done that and it actually being accepted well, oh no 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 we know the best way you know we, we do it as we you know so it's in the spirit of elizabeth gaskill people in this world are suffering exactly the same as in the 19th century so the same issues can be written about now as then i'm charles darwin <laughs> Quite surprised at all the people that had visited and who she knew. Yeah. Oh, that really surprised like Halley, me. Charles yeah. Halley and yeah. Charles yeah. Dickens. Dickens. I keep saying Darwin. Darwin. <laughs> he probably came as well. And the bronzes. And yeah. The only specific character perhaps is the, the leader of the <laughs> <laughs> The trouble at Mill Lot, you know. <laughs> Yeah, I suppose that's the only kind of character that I play. Yeah, everybody sort of switches and changes and becomes interchangeable, yeah. I couldn't do it at first. <laughs> kept getting the words mixed up and I kept saying I can't do this, I can't say that, but I've come, I've come on a lot. It's the talking. I forget my words and if, if I see somebody who I know in that, which I, I will do, I might just start laughing, I don't know, I'm a bit worried about that. The idea of the promenade performance where the audience is following you is uh, inspired, I think, really. You're just in your zone, aren't, aren't you? you? And yeah. I'm so out of it. <laughs> so out no, you're in it, you're in it, women. I thought I was coming to a choir, big, huge group, I said to my son, I might join a choir. He said, you can't sing. I said, it doesn't matter. You sink into the background in a choir. That's the whole point. The next minute, I'm acting. <laughs> Get in the, I'm just really That's not comfortable so with it. fab. Clifton and Naomi and and um, Erica and Claire, yeah. they were pleased with our performance. Mm. So um, we hope today we can do better or do the same. Yeah, you yeah. Know, where they, and possibly, I don't know, in the future, will they draw, do more performing here? I don't know. I'm looking forward to performing. I always suffer with nerves. I've been doing it for 10 years. I still get nervous. So some of the other women are like, I'm so nervous. I don't worry. <laughs> That's completely normal. But yes, I am looking forward very much. Let the women rise! Well, I knew it was going to be a musical, yeah, so I was definitely expecting music. Um, and I was hoping it was going to utilise the house, but I was really pleased that it was pretty much the whole house, wasn't it? Yeah. We yeah. got to see everything, so that was great. Definitely. I think I was expecting lots of stuff about Elizabeth Gaskell, but there were, there were lots of mentions of other kind of key figures from around that time and lots of sort of uh, other people's stories in it, which was great. To have that bit at the end with like the speaker and actually the and sort of choral stuff. Yeah, and the music amazing. as well. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, the music really was good. great. It's quite powerful, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. So that was really good. I feel like it's way yeah. bigger than I, I ever so. could have hoped at the beginning of this yeah. project. Me too. And I think for the women's experience, yeah. how they feel yeah. from those women who came on those first sessions to how they're feeling now, having performed. Yeah. That, it's amazing. I'm excited because it's opened so many doors for me that I thought were closed at my age. <laughs> you know, it's been brilliant. I've enjoyed being Mrs. Gaskell. I feel like Mrs. Gaskell at times, you know. And um, I don't know, I just hope I'm getting the message out there, do something about what's wrong today. It's lovely to see for the women themselves and myself, when you see your own words in print and they're being said, um, I think it's given some of the women on this project a real boost of confidence. You might see my name in light shirt. <laughs> you know, it's, it's, it's the best of, of theatre or music theatre when people are doing it for themselves to the standard that I think they've got to is, mm. is phenomenal. <laughs>